Welcome to the Right Facts Resource Center. Today, I will be showing you how to create a PCL cover sheet. This can be useful for organizations that want to reduce the time taken to convert cover sheets and do not need to edit the cover sheet in the future. Note, to create a PCL cover sheet, you will first need to have a cover sheet enabled printer. For instruction on how to do this, please refer to the link below the video. To begin, let's open Microsoft Word and start with a blank document. Determine the information you would like to display on your cover sheet. For example, let's enter two fax number, two fax name, from notes. Next, we need to map the information above to the relevant cover sheet codes. When the right fax server generates the cover sheet for an outgoing fax, it will replace the cover sheet codes in the template with the data they represent. On the line where we want to map the information, insert the relevant cover sheet code. You can find the full list of embedded codes using the link below this video. It is important to note that the embedded codes need to be in a printer type font, such as courier or universe. Repeat the steps with the remaining codes. For notes, determine the number of lines you want for the field. For example, if you want five lines, copy the note text section five times. Finally, go to the main menu and select print. Select the appropriate cover sheet printer. You should now see the print to file dialog box appear. Name your cover sheet and end the file name with PCL. Finally, save as all files. You have now created a PCL cover sheet. Remember, you can't edit the PCL file directly. If you want to edit the cover sheet in the future, you will need to save this Word document and generate a new updated PCL file. Next, I'd like to show you how to get this cover sheet into WriteFax to be sent with outbound faxes. WriteFax administrators will need to do this to make the cover sheet available to end users. Let's begin in Enterprise Fax Manager. Go to Cover Sheets, right-click, and select New. Enter ID, enter a unique name for the cover sheet, Description, enter a description for the cover sheet. Next, add the cover sheet template, select Import, and select the appropriate cover sheet and hit OK. The cover sheet template is now available in the cover sheet library. If you have any other right facts questions, please contact us using the information below and we'll be happy to reach out to you. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to get more right facts videos. If you want to access all of our right facts videos, go to rightfacts.atechnologies.com to register for exclusive access.